It's time for virtual story time. Not quite. Live. Yes. Okay. So, you know, it's Saturday. So, you know what that means. We're reading a book, series of books and singing some songs. Our story time is about fish today. Because you picked up this beautiful crab that was crafted by one a member of our wonderful youth services team. You guys should have also seen the tutorial. And so we're gonna read some books and learn a little bit more about fish. Yay! Hope you guys are excited as I am. So without further ado, let's go to our welcome song. I'll show you the books and we'll launch right into story time. Here we go. <laughs> we clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello. It's our friends of story time. We clap and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. With our friends of story time. We stomp and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. Hello. We wave and sing hello. Hello. With our friends of story time. We wave and sing hello. Hello. Hi. Welcome to virtual story time. Not quite live. <laughs> Okay, so here are the books that we're reading today. <clears throat> we have Swallow the Leader, a counting book. This book is by Dana Smith, illustrated by Kevin Sherry. There was an old pirate who swallowed a fish. This book is by Jennifer Ward, illustrated by Steve Gray. And finally, Look, fish. This story is by Stephanie Kalmenson, illustrated by Pui Pinolos. So excited. Okay, so without further ado, how about we get to our first book? And we're going to read Swallow the Leader. See, you know, Miss Magda needs, well, she doesn't really, but she likes to wear her trusty reading glasses. Be transported to a fun time. <laughs> All right, so the first book that we have for you today, Swallow the Leader, a counting book by Dana, by Dana Smith, illustrated by Kevin Sherry. Who knows how to count? Okay, here's an easy trick for those of you who are like, no, I don't really know how to count yet. Put up all your fingers, okay? wiggle them great and we just go through just pick one start from here or here and just go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that's right you got ten fingers and easy for counting and so i believe this book is going to go up to ten so as i go along just put up your fingers and start counting one fish. Two fish. Follow the leader. Do as I do. Splash when I'm splashing, then I'll follow you. Three fish. <laughs> follow the leader to coral caves. Snap like a crab. Ride on the waves. <laughs> Four fish. Follow the leader, wag your tail, swim to the surface, blow like a whale. Whales blow from like the top of their heads, right? Did you see it? There's like a hole at the top of their heads and they blow. The water comes out and they're riding that, that wave. <laughs> Five fish. Follow the leader, play like I play, pretend you are me. Flap like a ray, like a stingray, right? have these big, I don't know, are those wings? Like, what are they? Six fish. Follow the leader to the lagoon. Puff like a blowfish. Round as the moon. Okay, you guys want to puff like a, like a blowfish? Okay, so we're going to take... <sighs> Woo, that was weird. <laughs> Seven fish follow the leader into the dark. Hush, when I'm quiet, hide from the shark. Oh, 
hide, 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 hide from the shark. Okay, come back out because we got to finish the book. <laughs> Number eight, fish. Follow the leader. Go where I go. Trot like a seahorse. Stop when I. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Nine fish. Follow the leader. Leap when I leap. Hurdle a turtle down in the deep. Ooh. <laughs> These fish are having a lot of fun in the water, huh? hiding, they're riding the, the waves, they're, they're um, hurtling a turtle. Ten fish, follow the leader, float on your back. Open your mouth and <gasps> mm, eat a sea snack. Gulp, gulp, mm. Swallow the leader. <gasps> what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There. Oh, wait. That's not a fish. What is this one? <gasps> Swallow the leader. Eat a sea snack. Oh my goodness. What's happening right now? Swallow the leader. Nine fish. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eight fish. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <gasps> Seven fish. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six fish. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six fish. Oh my goodness. They're dwindling. They're swallowing the leader. Five fish. One, two, three, four, five. Four fish. One, two, three, four. That's three fish. One, two, three. Two fish, one, two. This is shark, y'all. This is shark. One fish, delish. No. Brrrr. Oh, look at that. All the fish are out. Excuse me. <laughs> now there are 10 fish again. Will you count with me? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two, four, six, eight, yeah, two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten fish. Follow the leader. Do as I do. You followed me. Now I'll follow you. <laughs> okay, so the shark, you know. He's a friend, actually. He's one of their friends. That is too funny. So I'll the leader accounting book. I hope you guys enjoyed that one as much as I enjoyed telling it. Well, I think what we'll do is actually, we're just going to go on to the next book because the next book is actually doubling as a song. So here we go. There was an old pirate who swallowed a fish by Jennifer Ward, illustrated by Steve Gray. Now I'm hoping it's gonna follow the same, you know, tune and cadence as there was an old woman who swallowed a fly. This book is published by Amazon Children's Publishing. There was an old pirate who swallowed a fish with a swoosh and a swish. Down went that fish. Blimey, but that fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo ho ho, watch his belly grow. There was an old pirate who swallowed a bird. How absurd, he swallowed a bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Blimey, blimey, what? <laughs> blimey, what? But the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo, ho, ho. Watch his belly grow. <laughs> Sorry. 
There was a no pirate who swallowed a map with a flip and a flap. It went down and unsnapped. He swallowed the map right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Blimey, what? The fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo ho ho. Watch his belly grow. There was an old pirate. Ooh, he's being chased. Or is he? Who swallowed some gold. Oh, he plundered, I'm told, then swallowed that gold. He swallowed the gold right after the map. He swallowed the map right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Slimy, but the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo ho ho, watch his belly grow. <laughs> There was an old pirate who swallowed a chest. Ooh, that's a big undertaking right there. He loves it best, that treasure-filled chest. He swallowed the chest right after the gold. He swallowed the gold right after the map. He swallowed the map right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Slimy, but the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow, Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo, ho, ho, watch his belly grow. Oh, there was an old pirate who swallowed a plank. <laughs> he walked that plank, then gave it a yank. He swallowed the plank right after the chest. He swallowed the chest right after the gold. He swallowed the gold right after the map. He swallowed the map right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Slimy, but the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo. <laughs> Yo ho ho, watch his belly grow. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo ho ho, watch his belly grow. There was an old pirate. Oh goodness, what is he gonna find out? What is he gonna swallow now? Who swallowed a sail? What? That couldn't have been appetizing. A grand old sail as big as a whale. Ooh, he's getting big. <laughs> he swallowed the sail right after the plank. He swallowed the plank right after the chest. He swallowed the chest right after the gold. He swallowed the gold right after the map. He swallowed the map right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Slimy, but the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo ho ho, watch his belly grow. There was an old pirate. What else is he going to swallow? <laughs> Look at his face, too. He's like, I don't want to swallow anything else. Who swallowed a mast. Oh, my goodness. He's swallowing the mast? It went down fast, that wooden mast. He swallowed the mast right after the sail. He swallowed the sail right after the plank. He swallowed the plank right after the chest. He swallowed the chest right after the gold. He swallowed the gold right after the map. He swallowed the map right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Slimy, but the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. Yo ho ho. Watch his belly grow. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Well. There was an old pirate. Yep, he's got it. He's going to swallow something else. There was an old pirate who swallowed a ship. What? There's no way. He, with a grip and a flip, down went the ship. He swallowed the ship right after the mast. He swallowed the mast right after the sail. He swallowed the sail right after the plank. He swallowed the plank right after the chest. He swallowed the chest right after the gold. He swallowed the gold right after the map. He swallowed the bat right after the bird. He swallowed the bird right after the fish. Slimy, but the fish was slimy. Why did he swallow it? I don't know. <laughs> Yo, ho, ho. Watch his belly grow. Oh, my goodness. There's no way he could swallow anything else, okay? That ship, after that ship, really? There was an old pirate, a captain he be, who sunk to the bottom of the deep. Dark. He... <laughs> yeah, he got too big and he, he, he sucked to the bottom 
all the deep dark things. And that is an old there was an old pirate who stole a lot of goods by Jennifer Ward, illustrated by Stephen Gray. Well <laughs> that didn't end too well for the pirate, did it? Okay, so now we're going to do a um <laughs> We're gonna do a um a rhyme. This one is there were five little fishies. So remember how we learned how to count how we started counting using these our fingers? That's one, two, three, four, five. So as I go through and I show you these, just make sure you you know reduce your fingers for whatever. Or you can go this way too. So like one, two, three, four, five. Whatever is easier on your fingers, okay? So here we go. There were five little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Shark. Oh, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Shark, as quiet as can be, and snap. Now, there are four little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Shark. You can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Shark, as quiet as can be, then snap. Now there were three little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Shark. Oh, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Shark, Ooh, as quiet as can be, then snap. Now, there were two little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Ch Shark. Oh, you can't catch me. Mm. Well, along comes Mr. Shark, quiet as can be, and snap. Oh. Now, there was one little fishy. Swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Shark. Oh, you can't catch me. <laughs> Along comes Mr. Shark, as quiet as can be, and snap. Now there were zero little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Shark. Oh, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Shark. Quiet as can be, then snap. Well, there are no little fishies left for Mr. Shark. Can't snap anything. They're all gone. He ate them all. He ate them all. Okay. <laughs> now, we're going to do one more rhyme. And this one, we're going to be using our fingers. You guys are so great at these, right? Okay, so we have, here we go. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five. I caught a fish alive. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I threw it back again. Why did you let it go? Because it bit my finger so. Ugh. Which finger did it bite? This little finger on my right. <laughs> Ooh, that was not a good bite. No, thank you, Mr. Fish. Don't eat my don't eat my hands. I need them to type. <laughs> well, that was really fun. And now we're going to read one more. We got one more book and we got one more song. And then I'm gonna let you guys go. So here we go. This book is called Look, Fish by Stephanie Cammonson. Look, fish, dive in and see how beautiful and amazing these creatures can be. The mouth of a parrot fish looks like a beak, but don't ask him questions. He cannot speak. This catfish has barbells like whiskers barbells like whiskers, but she doesn't meow or purr, and you wouldn't want to pet her. She has slimy scales instead of fur. Mm -mm. 
Let's undo that. What color are you, goldfish? If you said gold, you are right, but they can also be black, red, yellow, or white. Did you guys know that? They can be all different kinds of colors, these goldfish. Using his front fins, the mud skipper comes ashore. Have you seen a fish walking on land before? What? Fish can walk on land? Mud skipper can? The black marlin is a great big fish that can travel really fast. If you put her in a fish race, you can bet she won't be last. Whoa. Good things for marlins, huh? The seahorse is the slowest fish. He doesn't move the way the other fish do. And it's the father who carries the babies. He's got a pouch like a kangaroo. Whoa. Can you imagine? Lantern fish have dots that glow, lighting their way wherever they go. Flying fish leap from the water. They glide gracefully through the air. Large fish who are enemies can't catch them way up there. A porcupine fish has spines that lay flat until he gets scared when he's prickly round and fat. The lionfish is a hunter. She is a fish to fear. Her spiky, spi her spiky spines have poison. Warning, do not go near. Warning, warning. Look at the garden eels. Aren't they a lot of fun? They're like blades of grass reaching up toward the sun. Attention fish and mammals, stay far from the electric eel or he'll zap you with his current, then you will be his meal. Whale sharks are giant, gentle giants. They're the biggest fish in the sea. Some are as long as a school bus. That's how big these fish can be. Meet the dwarf pygmy goby, one of the smallest fish of all. If this little fish were standing, she'd be just half an inch tall. You see on a magnifying glass how small that fish is? Thanks to the sucking disc on her head, here's what a remora will do. She'll hitch a ride on another fish and eat his leftovers too. Wow, that remora is quite resourceful. Clownfish are not harmed by the poison of anemones, so that's where they hide to stay safe from their enemies. Mm, you guys remember a very famous clownfish, right? Nemo, anyone? <laughs> when a cleaner wrasse wants something to eat, tidbits from the skin and mouth of other fish are her treat. Well, that's cool. Fish helping fish. Fish friends helping fish friends. Stingrays can hide as nature planned on the ocean floor under the sand. Fish provide food for people and other living creatures. Fish are used to make medicines for scientific research. Wow. Fish are beautiful in the wild at an aquarium and at home as pets. Look, more fish. Look at all these fish. You guys can pause and take a look at all these different fish on this page. And I'm going to now move on to the last song and I'm going to dismiss you. Yay. Well, thank you for reading those with me. Now, let's do one more song, and it's going to be Here is the Sea, and it's um, to the tune of I'm a Little Teapot. Well, I'm a Little Teapot. So, here is the sea, the, no, here is the sea, the wavy sea. Here is a boat and here is me. <laughs> All the little fishies down below wriggle their tails and away they go. Or really, <laughs> wiggle their tails and away they go. <laughs> that was fun. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that song and all the other songs and books or rhymes that we did today. And now, I know, I know you guys are so sad, but Miss Magda will be back next week, so you guys can just, like, you know, check us out on our regular story time days. Those are Tuesdays and Thursdays, and um, we also have Robin, who gives us story time on Wednesdays, and 
Yeah, we're Saturday story times like today. Okay, so just join us for all of those fun things. In the meantime, here are the books that we read today. Swallow the Leader, a counting book. This book is by Dana Smith, illustrated by Kevin Cherry. There was an old pirate who swallowed a fish by Jennifer Warren, illustrated by Kim Gray. And Look, Fish by Stephanie Kalmanson, illustrated by Hui Pinillos. Thank you so much. And now we're just going to sing our goodbye song. We wave goodbye like this. We wave goodbye like this. With our friends, it's story time. We wave goodbye.